This is The Woody Show. The Woody Show. So you guys know us, it's uh, not often that we have guests in studio, but man, how do you say no when the guest is Green Day? You can't. Oh, no. You can't. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Oh, so Joe, Mike, Trey, welcome you guys. Thank you. This is a, a big morning, but I would like to start by saying that Green Day is making their triumphant return to the iHeartRadio Music Festival. Yes. Oh, be great. yes. 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 I mean, there was the last time you were at the festival, which, by the way, I know uh, there was a lot of, you know, controversy or talk or people talking about it. That was such a rock and roll moment. That was so punk rock <laughs> and raw. Like, whatever happened to rock and roll where people were smashing guitars and there, I, there I, was that kind of stuff happening? Like, now, you know. I think that it's weird. I think there's a lot of people uh, uh, in the rock genre. And the problem with rock music is that people are trying to m write the feel good song of the year right. or something. Mm -hmm. yeah. And rock music's supposed to make you feel bad. <laughs> <laughs> and that was like, and that was the intention of the last time we at the iHeart Festival for me. I was like, I want to make everyone feel bad. Mm. So I've heard a couple new songs uh, from the new album, which is called "Father of All." Mm -hmm. Dot dot dot. Which mm -hmm. you guys just recently changed the title to that because it was it was supposed to be a little bit more. The dot 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 was supposed to be mother effer. Right. You can say four of those words. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Father of all, mother. <laughs> Yeah. Mm -hmm. dot, dot, dot. yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'll be the bleep. Go ahead, say it again, Mike. Father of all mother. <laughs> right, yeah, exactly. <laughs> what people expect from Green Day is for you guys to bring it. And it's it's a it's a rock record. Yeah. I think uh what do you think, Mr. Cool? I didn't consider it brought, Woody. <laughs> 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 yeah. I mean, you know, because it's got a lot of energy. Now I, I know there are some people because I mean you're outspoken, you talk about things on stage, you get political at times. This is not a political record, right? Uh not necessarily. I think it the that stuff is inside of the album. Um, but it's not not, not really like finger pointing or anything. I mean, I think like the current administration is sort of uh, they kind of give me diarrhea. Mm -hmm. So it's like, I'd rather uh, just <laughs> not have it. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, uh, like, what is the new record for you guys? What were you going for? It, it It's like super rock and roll, kind of the history of, of rock and roll, but put through like Green Day energy. So we're, we're messing with stuff that's like more garage and Motown and uh, soul music and a little bit of glam and power pop and sort of mixing up also with like, like uh, some kind of trying to kind of create space within the, the uh, between the drums and, and the vocal a little bit, if that makes any sense. But, um, but fully charged. It's a, the, the record's 26 minutes long, which is, wow. the, I think mm -hmm. it's the shortest record we've ever made. I mean, even since like Dookie and Insomniac, so it's, uh, but it's just, just straight up rock and roll music. And then the other thing we're talking about is Hella Megator, mm, which yes. I love the name of it. I love that name. Oh, Hella thank Megator. You. Right yeah. on. Mm -hmm. Right on. You well, you're Bay the, Area guys. Can you say that with some oomph, please? Hella Mega. Megator. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, because Greg and, and, and Manis are both from the Bay Area. Yeah. So oh, Hella. Yeah. The Hella so thing. Yeah, Hella cool. Tour. This is a great tour. Green Day, Fall Out Boy, and Weezer. Wow. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I mean, we just want to like uh, come out with something huge, and um, we love Fall Out Boy, we love Weezer, and um, helps that we're on the same management, and so yeah. we're like, <laughs> let's just go out and uh, have a great it's time. It's all stadiums. Yeah, that's gonna be a that's lot. It's gonna of fun. be epic. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So was it just something that you, did you and the other guys uh, from Weezer and Fall Out Boy talk about this, or was this something that was brought to you? Like, how did this thing come together? Well, we wanted to play stadiums. Um, and so we, uh, we ended up, uh, with our manager and at crush and they, uh, not to sound all music business -y or anything like that, but we, they just said, well, why don't we just put all three bands on? And we we're I, like, immediately we were like, hell yeah, that sounds fun. So I, many great songs. Yeah. All night, all night long is going to be yeah. a, a lot of great, great music. And, Everything um, about yeah. it is going to be hella mega. Hella, yeah. hella, mega. Yeah. hella yeah. mega. Whose idea was that? Who came up with hella mega tour? Yeah, yeah, I think Mike. Good job, Mike. Mike. Uh, yeah, great choice. Yeah. Do you get nervous anymore? Like when the new album comes out or, you, you know. Do you yeah. Get, it's always, every time you step on stage, you get like the, the nerves? It's like a it... combination of um, being really excited and having a panic attack. 
is yeah. sort of, <laughs> but that's sort of like, yeah, I mean, give me something to worry about and I'll make a good rock song out of it. So yeah. I'll ask you guys favorite, favorite song of all your songs, favorite song to play on stage. Oh God. Wait, Jeez. I think, uh, probably Jesus of Suburbia. Yeah. Yeah. No. Yeah. Well, right now. Father of all, dot, dot, yeah. dot. Yeah. <laughs> something new. Yeah, it's yeah, just something yeah. about playing a, you know, uh, ripping through a new song that is yeah. just, uh, you just, it, it's that. Feels like the first time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, at what point did you guys realize that this was Hella Mega? Hella yeah. Mega. Yeah, yeah. 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 this is Hella Mega. Like, Disney not that you made job. it, I hate, yeah. I hate, uh, we made it, but like, at what point did you realize, like, holy crap, like, this is, this, this is, is really life. something, yeah. yeah. Uh, yeah. Probably. Yeah. Was there a moment after like, Woodstock? Yeah. Uh, yeah. You know, in uh, ninety yeah. yeah. yeah, four. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That was that was like when all the Dookie hit the fan. Right. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Everything like for us that was like such a it was I guess it was a viral moment when um when yeah. at, right after Dookie um uh, during the Woodstock show yeah was when it was like oh sh-, you know and we were. We were the opening band at Lollapalooza, and uh, and then people were, as we were playing, people would uh, pick up chunks of the, the the lawn and start throwing it around. <laughs> yeah, you know, they were just it caught on. Like you have this new album, mm-hmm. Father of All. Dot 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 in stores in February. Like, do you go into it looking at it as a complete album, or is these are just a bunch of different songs that you know uh, that we want to do, and we're just going to put them on this album? Well, I, I we Some definitely, we, yeah, we de- well, we definitely want to come up with like a vibe, like w- with what the record's going to be, which was just sort of more, um, kind of like the history of rock and roll, uh, but but more modernized, I guess you would say. Yeah. Um. So there was that feeling, and it was a feeling also where we, I really wanted to keep the song short and not, and it's like I realized I would look at what do you say it was yeah. twenty four minutes, twenty six minutes, twenty six yeah. minutes long. Yeah, 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 yeah. And so it was just sort of like I think now there's so much, there's a lack of censorship, and everything feels so genre fluid, and it's like you just you can just kind of put stuff out anytime you want, and there's yeah. no like look at like oh my god I got to fulfill this or fulfill a contra- the pressure of doing that. So that's why now it's so much more exciting because you can just put anything out. Yeah, you know, who knows? I'm maybe I'll be a SoundCloud rapper. Right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, because if you come up with an you know, like a song, and you really want to put that song out there, you don't have to wait for the album. You can just you know push that out. And <laughs> as a Bay Area guy, I know you guys had this this compound on this latest album. Did where did you record it? Did was it sh- still in the Bay Area, or did you go around different places? Oh, we recorded with um with uh, Butch Walker, um at his place Heard in San- in uh, uh, Santa Monica. It was okay. great. Yeah, yeah, we had a great. It's like he was, he's such a musical guy and has a lot of energy and just sort of like, it, we had we had a really great experience with him. So and then a little bit was recorded in Oakland, but the majority of it was in uh, was in Santa Monica. Nice. Now, Billy Joe, I know you uh, you recently worked with Morrissey. Is he uh, is he really as um, unique in person, like when you're when you're working with him as he seems? I, you know what? This is I I, ne- I I didn't work with him in person, but I met I met him outside of it. Uh, I saw him the other day, and um, uh, he he was great. He was like, "Oh, we are now friends. We have to hug now." That's what, and I'm like, <laughs> "Yeah, for sure, I'll hug you." You know, and then he's yeah. and he goes, um, he goes, he goes, so he goes, "You have a new album, right? Coming out?" I go, "Yeah." He goes, "Do you love it?" And I go, <laughs> I go. Yeah, I do. I, I I think I love it. And then he goes, um, "What's it called?" And he, I go, "It's called uh, the Father of All Mother." And he goes, "You got the bleep on there." He goes, "Oh my God, I can't believe it!" And he's like, "Whatever happened to Sergeant Pepper's Lonely Hearts Club Band?" <laughs> <laughs> That's so Morrissey. Yeah. <laughs> That's funny. He's great. He's and he's got one of the best voices ever i I love like that song came out great but before you meet a morrissey or let's say you guys are at the iheart radio festival and you run into def leppard if you haven't met like bands of your caliber meeting a band of that caliber do you guys act like you have met like oh hey what's up joe oh hey you get nervous sometimes actually like yeah because you'll have met somebody in a festival situation and like i don't mean i'm pretty oblivious like all the time i don't remember very much but uh so like 
I kind of assume that I've met everybody yeah. already. <laughs> so you just and say, I hey. treat you. I just yeah, I just will grab you and hug yeah, you okay. and be like, yeah, it's good. Like, yeah, you yeah, don't nice want to meet you. I'm like, moment. okay, cool. We're just meeting right now. Cool. Yeah. Right. Yeah. yeah you don't want that awkward moment of like, hey, nice to meet you. Oh no, we've met uh, yeah, uh, yeah. a number of times. No, we have it down now. It's like when we see someone and we can't remember their name or something. We, I, I'll like, I'll go. Hey, what's up, man? Right. And then Trey goes, "Hey, how you doing? I'm Trey." And they're like, "Oh, I'm Morrissey. <laughs> right. I'm <Yes>. Morrissey." <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, and I'm who's this guy? No. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and of course, the new album, "Father of All," dot dot dot, will be out in February. And the new single, which you can hear right here on the radio station, called "Father of All." Dot dot dot. Uh, Green Day, thank you so yeah, much for being God. here. Thanks to Woody Joe. Thank you, Woody Joe, yeah, Mike, yeah. And Trey. It is the Woody Show. We'll be right back. The Woody Show. This guy totally tried to touch my ding dong. Love the Woody Show. Oh. <laughs> I didn't know it was that kind of party. The Woody Show. <laughs> You're waking up with the Woody Show.